Good evening, everybody. Welcome back to Wade's Movie World. First off, let me apologize for not uploading for about 11 days now. I have been down and out with the COVID-19 Omicron variant virus. So, yeah, I've had to deal with that nonsense. And uh, what sucks is that I got both the shots of the Pfizer vaccine plus the booster, and I still got this crap. So, yeah. Uh, I think I'm pretty much in the clear now. I just have this lingering cough, which sucks because it hurts when I cough. But, uh, oh well, at least it's over and done with and hopefully I can get on with life. Uh, I hope all you guys are doing great out there and I hope none of you have caught this thing because it sucks. Uh, one of the worst things about this Omicron is it zaps your energy away from you. I mean, I have felt like just absolute nothing. I mean, it, it sucks. It really does. Uh, not having energy is not fun at all, plus you have a headache, and I had a little bit of fever, and yeah, it's just, it's not fun. And the fact that the vaccines don't work, it just, yeah, just a nightmare. Anyway, so let's stop talking about COVID-19, and let's get on with some other things. Let's talk about some TV news, shall we? How about some Superman and Lois news for you? So back in December of 2021, according to Collider.com, we're going to be getting some guest directors for Superman and Lois Season 2. And one of those directors is going to be someone who a lot of you may know if you watched Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the TV show, in your childhood like I did. And it's none other than the Pink Ranger herself, Kimberly Hart, Amy Jo Johnson. Yes, the Pink Ranger... It's morphin' time! Pterodactyl! Now you will feel the full power of the Zapper Apple! Uh, you won't get away with this! Uh. Goodbye, Power Rangers! Uh, 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 uh. Leave my friends alone, you snake! So according to Collider.com, in Superman and Lois, Amy Jo Johnson recently posted a photo of herself with Hecklin in his updated Superman suit while confirming that she will be directing an upcoming episode of Superman and Lois Season 2. The photo features Hecklin and Johnson standing outside and gives a full view of the suit. One of the biggest changes to the suit is Superman's boots. The boots now have a V-shaped tops similar to the boots the Man of Steel wears in the comics and animation. In her post, Johnson wrote, Last day of directing episode 206 of Superman and Lois. This has been absolutely the most thrilling experience of my career. Tyler Hecklin and Elizabeth Tulock and the entire cast were a dream to work with. Amy Jo Johnson goes on to say that Max Kronick and Patrick Barton Leahy really wrote a doozy for you guys. She says she loved every second of it and then she goes on to say, Now on to edit the episode and to go take a nap. Season 2 premieres January 11th, which has already happened. They've already had, uh, so far, two episodes, and so far the episodes have been okay. There's one particular part of the second episode I did not like, uh, but other than that, so far we're off to a great start for Season 2. So, yeah, I'm excited to see uh, what happens in Season 2, but that's not the only Season 2 uh, director news that we have. For the second episode, we already had another guest director that directed an episode in the first season come back. David Ramsey from Arrow came back to direct the second episode of the second season, and what a great job he did once again. And of course, you know the reverse flash himself, Tom Cavanaugh, who plays Eobard Thon and Harrison Wells on The Flash, did the season finale of season one. He directed that and did a great job. So yeah, we're getting some really good directors coming and we're not finished yet, but we've got another guest director coming. And that is, according to comicbook.com, none other than the agent of S.H.I.E.L.D. herself, Elizabeth Henstridge, Gemma Simmons, is crossing over to the DC side of things. Whoa, 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 shit! That's the Night Night gun. What? It's all my stuff and it doesn't work and there's no way we're calling it the Night Night the gun. The bullets work. Non-lethal, heavy stopping power, break up under the subcutaneous tissue. Yeah, the dose of only 0.1 microliters of dendrotoxin. I'm not Hermione. I can't create instant paralysis with that. 
You should have run the specs by the old day before building the mold or using the higher cover on those old ones. Physics or what's the other one? Inertia. Fitzsimmons. Fitz. Simmons. I'm engineering. She's biochem. Can we purpose the IDIS chip? Don't need the external receiver for the inner ear comms anymore. So, uh, how does it? Embedded sensor in your silicon match the DNA. It's very posh. So, were you excited to be coming on our journey into mystery? It's like Christmas. On Instagram, Henstrid shared a behind-the-scenes photo revealing that she is directing an episode of CW's Superman and Lois in the second season. In the photo, Henstridge is featured with the clapperboard from the episode, naming her as the director, noting in her caption that it's from the first shot and that she really can't say much at all about it, but promised that it would be a big episode. So yeah, she seems to be eager to be on board Superman and Lois as a guest director, and I can't wait to see the episode that she directs because she directed an episode in the seventh season of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., and she did a great job. The episode of Superman and Lois isn't Hentridge's first time behind the camera. Hentridge, who played Gemma Simmons on Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., previously, like I said, directed uh, the seventh season episode entitled As I Have Always Been. And this is not the first time that a well-known actor from another well-known franchise has stepped behind the camera for Superman and Lois. So, yeah, we're getting a lot of good guest directors coming on board, and I hope that means that these episodes are going to be great, and it's going to lead to some great episodes and great things throughout this season. I'm really looking forward to the remainder of season two. Uh, I just hope there's one thing they will stop doing that they started in the second episode. Uh, they need to just drop that entirely. And if they do that, this season will be great. That's it for the news as far as guest directors coming to Superman and Lois. Um, again, I apologize for me not uploading for so long. Like I said, I've been down and out with the COVID-19 Omicron variant. And uh, I've just had to rest up and just try to fight this thing and get back to normal. And like I said, I'm slowly getting there. I've still got a lingering cough, which is driving me nuts. But other than that, I'm symptom free. So I pray that none of y'all out there get it. And I hope you guys are having a great day. Okay, that's it for this video. I'm going to say thank you all so much for watching. Good night. God bless. I love all of you. And I will see you all in the next video. Until then, bye-bye. Stay safe and stay well, my friends.